before the trip, when you need to wash the car. Yep, that's winter for you. And now it's clean, and you won't see it like this in about 12 hours. It doesn't clean up good though. Look at this ice. This is what we're gonna be driving on today. And we're not taking that because of the vehicle stability control is off and that's not good on icy roads. So instead of that, we're taking that. This car does not have as much room as that car. That is an easy family hauler for a two day trip. Whereas this one, not so much. And especially when you have a tire in the back for weight, which we are going to have to take out because there is no way in the world we are gonna get all our stuff in for a family of four into a C63's trunk. Let's see if all this can fit into that. Go for it. Yes, this time we are taking the, the smaller car, the fun, cool car. Look at this, winter boots in Canada. Ugly, <laughs> ugly, ugly, ugly. Close her up. It works. It works. What is that? Hat. That's a hat? Yeah. That's why people come from all over the world to go see them. Things like that. People love mountains. Great skiing. People ski on too. mountains, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, the road is clear. So clear roads. You can't beat it. We've gone like 270 miles and uh, it's been like 21 miles to the gallon. But there was always some uh, in-city driving getting to the highway and of course the uh, Starbucks drive-through, which isn't exactly, uh, you know, highway speed. Yeah, but if you're looking for a getaway, this I is would, the place to go. This is the place to go. We're here in Banff, it's a beautiful day. <laughs> we made it, we made, we made it. it. With the car, pretty darn dirty. Pretty darn dirty. How was it on the way here? It was great. Yeah, it worked really well. The winter tires are great. You can definitely drive a sports car, a super with, cool sports car. In, with, with two kids. With two kids. All right, let's show you the To hotel. the mountain. Here we go, This is so warm. Aim, how much do you wish we could go down into that? Hey guys, you know what a man's room is like? This is what ladies' lounges look like. This is a ladies' lounge. This is where we come here to lounge. Lounge. Yes, there's lounging. There's couches. Yes, there's bathroom facilities. All very clean. No urinals, you might notice. Oh, you are literally lounging. Lounging. Oh, that is great. All right. There is a, uh, a diaper changer. That's great. Look at that. Wonderful. But yes. That's what a ladies' lounge looks like. Now let's show you the men's room. And this is how you know it's the men's room. Open the door. And yeah, sure enough, there's no lounging in the men's room, but we do have urinals. So, yes. Oh, Amy's peeking through. You can peek through, you just can't come in. But just in case anybody has any question as to whether you can travel in a C63 in winter, uh, we hit a storm on the way. Uh, we do have winter tires. It's uh, uh, Continental's on here, Viking 7 Contact, or Viking Contact 7. And you can see the road looks like junk. It's drifting snow, but it's been okay. Not that you'd want to travel in this if you didn't avoid it, but if you got to, you got to. And it's worked just fine. We're back and you can see, yes, it snowed quite a bit. Let's see what it looks like with the kids today. Ah, oh, yeah. So that is a problem. When you have a family car, you have family problems. And that means it is uh, disgusting. The car will be cleaned. But the fact is, when you take a sports sedan into the mountains, this is what you get. Get a dirty car, but we got there and back. And that is what mattered.